found out about the TDI challenge when I read an article on the manufacturer website. My project is a chick brooder, so it's an enclosure for baby chicks um, from when they are born up to about two months. And the idea is to make something that not only looks good to keep in your living room, but also has all the features for a chick to be healthy from up to two months. My project is a, it's a unique and contemporary shoe storage system. I think it's something to be proud of and it's, um, yeah, it's really encouraged me to go further with um, design and technology in the future. My project is basically RNLI, it's a search and rescue drone that they can use so they can throw it off the side of a lifeboat and go and look for a survivor in the water and it's completely autonomous so you just draw a, a rough area where you want them to search and it will go and perform a, a grid search in that pattern and then you can look at a live video coming back from it and find your survivor in the water through a thermal camera. My design brief was a no powered amplification unit. I made it with like different materials. My end product amplified sound a lot louder than I thought it would do. Our project was the binaural soundscapes of the blind. So effectively what we did was we just made uh, goggles that had sensors that help blind people sort of get a greater spatial awareness of their surroundings. Really excited to be here today. It's a fantastic opportunity to see so many young people engaging in brilliant design, engineering and technology work. Some fabulous projects, some really switched on kids um, that are learning skills that hopefully will stand them in really good stead for now and in the future. My project is a scale electric lap counter and timer. I'm, I designed the circuits in AutoCAD Eagle, prototyped them on a breadboard, designed the uh, case on 2D design, got that cut on the laser cutter, glued it together, uh, sanded the edges down, put it all together. Yeah. My project is an activity station for children. It's kind of aimed at nursery age children, age three to four. My thought was to provide them with a uh, a unique and innovative area where they can work and play um, and get them involved in uh, the nursery environment. My project is a Bluetooth bike indicator. I have two switch on the handlebars, they are 3D printed and then I have the helmet with the integrated indicators on the left and right side. My uh, project is for my GCSE DT and I wanted to make task writing for a desk or a table and with the five bars of lights it means there's no shadows produced and the curved 90 degree arc radius really adds to the design. My project today is the Port Apple. It's a portable Apple light which you can move around the library with and once the battery inside has died, you can put it back on the base and it will charge back up and then you can continue using it around the library. Our project was given to us by Micalte and it is a method of cooling a hub onto an alternator and the alternator is part of the generator which converts the rotational energy from the engine to electrical energy. 